Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, as y'all can see, I am... I said welcome back, like this is not my first video. As y'all can see, I'm in the bathroom trying to iron my hair. I'm running like a little bit behind, but I was like, I still kind of wanted to vlog today. Um, and do like a little week in my life type of video. But it's not really going to be a week, it's really about to be like three days. Because I have class, um... Monday, Mondays and Wednesdays, and on Tuesdays I have my clinicals, so I was just like, why not vlog my little nursing school experience and see if y'all like type of content like that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's currently 6.36, so I need to be leaving the house, like, right now, but I'm going to give y'all a little bit more intel into what I'm going to be doing in the hospital, just super exciting. I'm trying to decide if I want to wear a scrub cap right now, I don't, I don't know how to do it, I mean, my legs don't look too, too bad. Just don't look too hard. But today is also my big sister's birthday, so when you see this, sis, I love you. Mwah. Love you, girl. Yeah, I go to school in um, downtown Atlanta. So in the morning, there's traffic. So it, it'll probably take me around like 45-ish minutes, hopefully, to get down there. Um, but yeah, I wasn't about to film, no like fake little wake up session or nothing like y'all know how to help people get up for school um i have class in my lab for health assessment so i just got my stethoscope and my light in here i don't need to bring like my whole nursing school i don't gotta bring like my whole clinical bag or nothing like that ear ties in my bag turn off my flat iron Put on my lip gloss, cause duh. It's currently 6.39 and I still gotta go get coffee, so. All right, y'all, so it's currently 6.44. Um, still gotta go get coffee. Still got somewhere to be by 8 a.m. Um, I'm about to just see how long it's about to take me to get down there real quickly. What the hell, where did the 52 come? Ciao. 36, okay. I'm gonna go get my coffee anyway. <laughs> Later, or not Buki. I need to get my coffee. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know if you're supposed. To, well, it's not illegal to drive with the light on, so I don't really care. But um, I'm trying a different flavor of coffee today. I usually get the French vanilla, but tonight I'm gonna get the mocha swirl because I'm just feeling like that girl. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully this line is not long because that's gonna blow me. But yeah, over here driving with my light on, they're probably looking at me like, "What the hell is he doing?" Let me turn these bitches on. Oh, uh. So I'm gonna get there at 7.35. It's not too bad. Um, maybe traffic right now anyways. But it's like, I don't think I'm ever usually late, but I'm not usually the best at being on time either. You know what I'm saying? So, listen to some summer walk. Why are they all on my butt like that, girl? Like, back it up. Hello, I'm picking up my mobile order for Jasmine. Yeah, phone call, please. All right, thank you. Yeah, they said he was out. You're welcome. Yeah, he said it was out now. Because before they were trying to tell me that they don't serve mocha no more. And I'm like, what the hell do you mean you don't serve no mocha no more? You don't serve it today. I be feeling so studious in my little universe. You want a Um, no, it's good. Thank you. You too. I got that mocha with the little coat foam on top. What y'all know about that? I don't know nothing. <laughs> I low key should have said, um, like, I wanted light ice because they be kind of OD on the ice. But I mean, it's iced coffee, so I mean, uh. Mm. Oh! Oh, that junk! I'm up. I want to listen to some music. Um, I'm gonna try to listen to a little bit on. Um, on her but you know I don't want to get copyrighted or anything so I'm gonna have like little short clips but I'm gonna really start filming more when it gets a little lighter outside because it's really dark okay now everybody getting over and don't want to let a bad bitch over to me but yeah I'm gonna start filming a little bit more when it gets lighter outside because I want to listen to music and I'm freaking tired so I'm not it's not like exactly bright outside it's not like exactly bright outside but um Cause of, you know daylight savings time and everything but um i'm like 10 minutes away from school right now 
And this idiot had tried to cut me off the road, trying to zip past me. Like, he couldn't just stay where he was at. And then I look on the back of his truck, he got a, a Blue Lives Matter sticker. That, that nigga was part of the clan. Okay, he was part of the clan. I, like, I'm already knowing. Like, and I'm just like, why would you drive? Like, why are you driving like you're trying to cause a car accident? Or you can just stay where you at. Like, I'm, I'm not a slow driver. I promise you I'm not. So it's like, what's, like, what's going on? What's going on? Like, ooh. one of my nursing friends, she picked up our badges, um, that we need to, like, scan into different places of the hospital. So I'm going to add that to my badge room. I'm taking a class. Um, room and instant. I'm about to go in the park right now. I'm just seeing. You know all the bullshit that's been going on with you today. And, you know, I don't know if the room by destroying your moment. What are you doing? Sending your business to the world. Say why you, you know, decided to be a rich nigga even though you have problems. Put that drama in your me. Anyways, y'all, I'm parked. Um, It's 7.41 right now. I usually start walking in at around, like, 7.45. Um, Obviously, I'm not about to walk around downtown Atlanta with this big-ass camera. So I'm about to record off my phone. I'm really just about to be in class, for real. So today I have um, pathophysiology first, and then I have pharmacology, and then I have my health assessment class. And then for health assessment after that um, class, we have a lab, which we usually just practice our head-to-toe assessments. Um, right now we're at the gastrointestinal and like the re the renal area, so we're gonna like check for bowel sounds and stuff like that. Yeah, today's about to be kind of a chill day. I mean, it's like the longest day that I have, because it's just like. The longest classes ever. Tomorrow is really when it's going to start being exciting because I'm about to be doing my clinicals at the one and only Level 1 Trauma Center in the Metro Atlanta area. So I'm super excited about that. Um, to, you know, take care of people and learn a little bit. But I'll, I'll let you guys in a little bit more on exactly what I'm going to be doing in the hospital um, a little bit later because it's a lot of ground to cover. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to try to record as much as I can today and tomorrow and on Wednesday, but yeah. I just wanted to kind of give y'all like you know a little the spiel on what we're doing so we're practicing our head to toe assessments it's going well so far um we have validations for head to toe assessments next month like i think it's like april 20th or something like that i'm not 100 percent sure but i think it's around that time um but yeah so we're just doing that and right now i have to pee so bad so we got like 27 minutes left in lab because we end lab at 5 30 and then i could finally head the home um and then i'm gonna catch up a little, a little bit later but i think this is all i'm about to film for today because i'm well no actually i'm, I'm I, I need to go to target because i need to get some coffee for tomorrow um because i kind of have to wake up at like 4 30 so to go to target uh, me and my little sister are probably gonna go to target and get that but um i'm trying to talk a little low because i don't want nobody to hear me but um yeah so i'm in the bathroom we got the replacement shoe. I might need to buy some of those because I need these in the Anyway, so this is the creamer that I'm getting. Um, this is the one that she they use at Duncan. Cold and she over here trying to vlog too, but this is the cream that they use in the Dunkin' Donuts one. But I'm looking here and it's I see coffee. they only got the coffee cream right, not the actual coffee mix that I use. So I'm a little confused. Well, I don't go nowhere with kids because now she over there walking around. When I'm over here trying to leave the stove. That's what I'm talking about.
anyways guys we just got back in from target um after skylar ran down this whole store getting god knows what so skylar just go ahead and show them what you got the only thing i got was um a vanilla frappuccino for tomorrow because i will not be able to wake up so exactly and in reality she don't need to drink no coffee she needs Shut to up. just go to sleep earlier but it's currently day two it's tuesday um like i said i was not about to film no fake waking up with me type of situation it is currently 5 18. i'm about to go downstairs and make my coffee because i got some stuff from Target to make some coffee because it's, it's really really early i don't really feel like stopping at duncan even though duncan opens at five so i'm just gonna make my own because why not i'm wearing this little fanny pack <laughs> i don't know if y'all can see but i'm wearing this little fanny pack and i'm trying to go in there you know positive mindset with like a goal and a plan because I want to feel like I accomplished something at the end of the day. Like, I don't want to just walk in there and just, like, have to hide behind my nurse the whole time. Like, you know? And obviously, I, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. But they don't gotta know that. Ooh, that was a little rough. So, I'm gonna try. I have to be... We're meeting in the Starbucks at 6.15. I mean, sorry, at 6.30. And I want to get there around 6.15 so I could park and figure out life. And just process and woosa. I'm about to head out. Alright, so right now I'm about to make my coffee. I'm just about to put some ice in here real quick. And just hold it in there like that. Okay. And I'm gonna put a little bit of this caramel macchiato cream in here. <clears throat> I'm gonna fill the rest up with um whipped cream because I love me some whipped cream. So if y'all can see that. product and yeah so I have my um clinical pack, clinical pack right there it just has everything that I need for class I said for class for the clinical the all right so now I have my clinical bag my coffee my Stanley and we're ready to go so okay so <clears throat> I'm still making good time. Um, it says that I'm supposed to get there at 6.12, which I literally was just trying to um, get there by 6.15. So, like I said, I'm going to catch you guys up a little bit on what I'm going to be doing in the hospital. Um, so, like I said, I am doing my clinicals at the number one and only accredited Trump level one trauma center in the metro Atlanta area. Um, if you know, you know. If you don't, you, you don't. But, um, yeah, so my unit is oncology and hematology. So I'm going to be um, assisting with um, cancer patients. I don't really know 100% about the hematology aspect of it. Um, I know that has something to do with blood. So maybe, like, stem cell transplant, something like that, you know. Because I'm sure that when you have cancer patients, you need to monitor certain levels in their blood very closely um so again i don't know exactly how this is about to go i'm like a little bit nervous but um every day is a learning experience and yeah you know um i did, i want to go like i said earlier like i want to go in there with a plan i don't want to just um go in there expecting like to follow my nurse around 100 percent of the time like i want to learn how to do things by myself and I just want to learn how to be the best nurse that I can possibly be. Um, my end goal, I do want to end up in a ICU type of situation um, because I think that that's more than likely where I would thrive. Um, 
I like using critical thinking skills and I feel like the ICU is definitely the place for me. I was I'm really interested in the NICU, so the neonatal ICU. Um, just with the little bitty babies, I just feel like, you know, I have the personality for it. Um, and yeah, so this is kind of like my manifestation diary and kind of me documenting um, my journey until I get where I want to be. But yeah, so again, this is a med surge clinical. Um, I have my med surge clinicals, then I have psych, um, then I have o OB and then peds or, or peds and OB. I don't remember either which way, but I'm excited for all of my clinical rotations. I'm just, I don't know. I feel like you, like, there's only so much that you can learn in clinical. I mean, there's only so much that you can learn in lab. Like, sometimes you just have to do like you have to be hands-on and do something to really like grasp the entirety of the situation so you know like you can put a foley catheter in a dummy but like putting a foley in on like a real human being like a real actual person like that's a different ball game but yeah so that's basically um what i'm about to be doing i'm gonna try to record as much as i can in the hospital obviously i can't record too much because of hipaa um, I'm not going to be recording any patients or anything like that because it's crazy. But um, I'm going to try to record, you know, as much as, like, you know, I can and, like, what I'm doing. Um, again, I'm not bringing my camera in that hospital because it's a crazy hospital. I'm not bringing my camera in there. But, um, oh, no, I just got a notification about my clinicals. But, yeah. So I'm just about to listen to music. And then I'm going to have a little chat with you guys when I'm in the parking deck. And then, you know, we'll go throughout the day and then at the end we'll do like a like a like a little recap. You know what I'm saying? Just you know, some things that I did on my own and yeah. Hey, fuck all my bitches on friends. Hey, hey, let that girl fuck anybody. She out there catching everybody. Uh, this song is low-key insane because he's over here blaming his 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 new girl's friends. Be her her friends, old friends for the people that she's had sex with. Like what type of craziness is that? But the song is amazing. This is the best song in the album for real. But yeah, I'm about to listen to music, so change I don't tell you. I'm the H N I C I'm not from spamming. I got to tell you what I mean. Suffocating every time it locks me in. Painting their own pictures and they crop me in. But I will remain with the top begins. Cause I am not a word, I am not a line. Sent an entire generation. I hear the criticism loud nay. But when you go hard, your names become yays. Yankee Stadium with Jays and Kanye. So it is currently 2.36 p.m. Obviously p.m. Like, girl, duh. Um, I'm just now getting in the car. Let me put some hand sanitizer on. I don't think about it. But um, I'm just now getting in the car. Today was a pretty calm day. I mean, it's like I wanted to record more, but there's only so much that you can record when it comes to, like, working in a hospital because um, HIPAA. 
you can't record your patients you can't rec- you know there's just certain things that you just can't record so to sum up today um we basically you know did like some med passes um bed changes um and this one bed change was really difficult because um he was on anti-nausea medication and like every time we would try to reposition the bed he would have to throw up so it was just like you know that was kind of exciting it wasn't too crazy um you know then we had our little wrap-up session had some difficult patients as well but you know i guess that like that just that just kind of comes with the territory um they're in a very vulnerable state in their life so you know you have to understand that you know these people go from being able to do basically anything for themselves to having to rely on somebody almost 100 percent. so it's a difficult adjustment so them being irritable or you know not compliant in the way that you want them to be is completely understandable in my opinion um so we only got one more day left um which is wednesday wednesday is just only classes so i get to wear normal clothes hallelujah i get to wear normal clothes hallelujah because i uh being in uniform 24 7 it's just it's a lot but um yeah so i'm about to head home right now um honestly i'm gonna probably talk to y'all when I get home um just if I end up doing anything and then if not then I'll see you tomorrow morning so today is officially the third and last mother freaking day of my nursing school week it is Wednesday March 20th it's currently 6 37 a.m so I'm currently about to head out the house then I'm about to go to Duncan and pick up my coffee I got three things that I have to attend to, so I'm not going to end up leaving school until around, um, like, five. Usually on Wednesdays, I would leave school around, um, 2, 15, 2.30ish, but today I have to take my ATI practice test. Um, it's just a practice, so I didn't, like, study for it or anything like that, but that starts at 2.30 and ends at 4 o'clock. So, it's supposed to be kind of a short terror day, but I realized last night that I have to take that quiz tomorrow. Well, today, I'm sorry. So this is the look. I'm just wearing this little pink hat. This is Brooklyn, 95 degrees, whatever. And then this little babe hoodie and some black leggings. And then I'm probably about to wear, like, I don't even know what she was about to wear. Probably some, I don't know. We're going to figure it out. I ended up just wearing my, uh... Yeezy, whatever these is called. So I'm about to head out now. Because I'm kind of running behind. But. Alright y'all. So I'm about to place my Dunkin' order. But why does John saying that it's about to take me 54 minutes to get up there? I don't know. But am I still about to place my Dunkin' order? <laughs> yes ma'am. I actually think I have enough points on here for a free one. Oh yes I do. I most certainly do. I know that's right. Coffee and cold brew. So I'm about to head out now. Cause it's now 6:49, and I'm kind of tripping, kind of tripping, but I'm on the way. Ah, where my husband at? Anyway. Ah. Hello, I'm picking up my mobile order for Jasmine. Please put forward, please. All right, thank you. You're welcome. It's so cold, y'all. I'm so upset. Cause it's supposed to be spring. I don't know why we still acting like we in January. I think spring starts like this week. I think it's still technically winter, but I don't give a f I need to get hot so I can just like a hoe. And chase girls. Yeah, I'm about to be on the toilet. There's no way. But I really just ordered this bit because it was free. But I got me the large. Um I'm talking about like I got me this large iced coffee. This junk is huge, bro, and it got the little cream foam on top.
All right, y'all, so I'm officially home. I take a shower, everything. I'm about to go to sleep forever. Yeah, I hope this gave you guys like a little glimpse of what it's like being in nursing school. Um, I plan on making a lot of other content surrounding nursing school. I wanna talk about like the T's test, your prerequisites, getting into nursing school, my stats and everything like that. Um, but if you did like this video, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.